The problem of uh, HIV infection in adolescence is a quite a serious problem, even if it's not uh, anymore considered now in the European countries. There is a problem that is different in European countries compared with the so-called developing countries. In European countries, there is a lack of attention to the problem of the adolescents with, uh, living with HIV, because now there are a number of children that survived to the disease uh, and became adolescents. So it's quite important to explain the fact uh, that they are HIV infected uh, since uh, at uh, one age it is a, a proper age, not so late, not too late, with the help of the parents if available and explain that uh, HIV now is considered uh, a sort of uh, normal disease, uh, not a special disease. And uh, with this disease, uh, those adolescents can, be, uh, can have a normal life uh, and uh, having also uh, sexual intercourse uh, with their own partner if they want. The only thing is that uh, uh, it is quite important to explain that uh, they have to protect the partner and they have to tell to the partner the fact that they are HIV infected. The, one of the most important things is that they have to follow properly the treatment because if they follow the treatment uh, properly, they have uh, a viral load undetectable during their life for years and years. And this uh, is related with the lack of transmission uh, in sexual intercourse. But, uh, of course, uh, it's very important to remember and to explain them to protect sex having, using the condoms, because the condom is a very perfect way to protect the uh, partner that is not infected, but also the partner that is infected, because we haven't to share the, the viral, the, the virus that one person have with those that have the partner. So for adolescents, it's very important to inform them, inform those that are around them about uh, the normality of HIV infection, the normal possibility of life, and the possibility to have a normal uh, sexual life.